was part in the path of today's total eclipse. Tom? Oh, guys, it was absolutely amazing. Do you know, seven years ago, we stood on the same ridge at Little Grassy Lake, about five hours by drive, by road, uh, 300 miles south of Chicago here in far southern Illinois near Carbondale, and we took in this entire spectacle. And what a spectacle it was. You know, it's interesting. This, uh, this hillside was littered with folks. I mean, 20 states represented in this one campground in Southern Illinois. Every campground, every hotel room was full and has been for months uh, coming into this area. And folks came down with kids and with uh, seniors and all. I mean, there were people of all ages and in all walks of life came down to witness an amazing celestial event that was today's total solar eclipse. Now this one lasted four minutes, whereas the one in 2017 lasted two minutes at this spot. And the one in 2017 was in August. It was horrendously hot, 90 degrees that day. Today was a gorgeous 76 degrees and we had beautiful skies. The consensus here is that today's eclipse came off better than the one in 2017, and 2017 was my first. But I'll tell you, it was amazing. You know, these eclipses take about an hour, hour, 10 minutes to come onto an area. And then that last five minutes as you're approaching the totality, uh, day goes to night, and it's a change. The stars come out in the middle of the afternoon, uh, the planets come out, and you see this amazing corona around the disk of the sun as the moon moves across it. And today, we saw a solar flare coming out uh, from the corona. So it's, it's just amazing. It was an incredible, incredible, I think a life-altering event for most folks who were here and saw it, guys. Really something. Looks that way, Tom. And were there as many people there as in 2017? More, Ben, uh, by, you know, 60% more people were in the path of totality on this one because the moon's a little closer on this eclipse than it was in 2017. And it was reflected in the turnout around here. We had people in this campground who had driven in from Montana and also from Utah. So it was amazing. Very yeah, cool. Yeah, more people for sure. Yeah, very cool to see, Tom, and we're glad you got a chance to cover it for us. Thank you. Thank you, Lourdes. Good to see you too, Ben. See you later, guys. More from you throughout the evening. Let's show you how the eclipse looked.